morning. I have just realised that I have locked myself out of my house the day before I go to New York, but that's okay. <laughs> Joe, my handyman's got my keys. So, how do you buy properties that are discounted? How do you lock in your profit when you buy a property? How do you buy BMV, below market value properties? Can't be done. Yes, it can. We need 200 of these. £45 million worth of property that we got an agreed purchase price of 30 million quid on in less than five years. So if we can do it, you can do it. That's more or less one a week. Uh, it can be done. It can be done. It's a numbers game. There is a small number of people that want to sell a house wholesale because they need other traits, whether it's speed or um, a complete reliability of you being their purchaser. Right. Here's the maths. Estate agents, 100 phone calls, 25 viewings, 21 offers, and between one and two will get over the line. Typically one. So 100 phone calls to estate agents, 25 viewings, 21 offers, one will get over the line. If your maths are not like that, you need to evaluate each part of the chain. What are you doing that you need to improve on the phone calls, the viewings, the offers in order to get it over the line? Uh, auctions, one in four houses that I assess, I'll buy. I know that. I've tracked my maths the entire time. And the most fun time we had, and the most slightly stressful time we had, we tried to buy 30 houses at auction from the same auction, which was really fun and really full on. Um, so we tried to buy 30. Guess what we bought? Seven. So it's pretty much those maths. So one in four houses you buy from auction, you should buy. So what's the rule of game? A rule of thumb? Never go to auction trying to buy one house. Minimum, try and buy four, if not eight, and you'll get between one and two houses. Good luck. Property, it's a numbers game. You lock your profit in when you buy.